If you searched for Minecraft mod showcases during the 2013 to 2016 period, one mod would stand out from all the others, a mod called Allspawn. Yet today, if you search for the Allspawn website, you'll see that it's been taken over by whatever this is. How did this mod go from being the king of Minecraft to this absolute train wreck? What happened to the creator of the mod and where is he now? To answer these questions, we'll have to go all the way back to the beginning. On the 27th of April 2013, a new mod was published to the Planet Minecraft forum by a user known as They Call Me Danger. The mod initially included features such as ultimate tools and armor crafted with titanium, uranium, and iron, apple cows, butterflies, and moths, and the now controversial girl. You, this is the bread that you asked me to get, and you can now go make me a sandwich. Anyway, you can see why this is controversial nowadays, but what nobody realised at the time was how it foreshadowed the kind of person the mod maker would be to add a feature like this. More on that later. The mod was relatively successful early on, receiving 332 downloads in the 6 days after it was uploaded, and even early on received several positive comments. By June of that year, the downloads skyrocketed to 1591 and the views to 5796. It was clear by then that this mod was going to become something big in the Minecraft community. On June the 17th, 2013, the mod was even featured in a Dan TDM mod showcase which could only have a positive impact on the success as a whole. But one YouTuber whose success partly revolves around this mod, popular MMOs, likely helped this mod to grow as much as the mod helped him. One of the first videos featuring the mod was his video simply titled Minecraft Girlfriends, which was released on the 23rd of September 2013, and as of when this video is uploaded, has 4.8 million views. At the time, popular MMOs had 88,000 subscribers on his channel, but just one year and 12 Allspawn videos later he had 1.5 million subscribers. And at the same time the Allspawn mod now had 400,000 downloads on its Planet Minecraft page. It all looked like it was going up for They Call Me Danger. On the 16th of November 2014, They Call Me Danger uploaded a video titled A Brand New World to his personal YouTube channel, Richard Clark. In it, he went through a new game he was making on the sidelines while he was developing the Allspawn mod. So far, all it consisted of was a basic 3D engine that rendered the same repeated chunk over and over. The video itself had nothing wrong with it, however, it marked the end of him uploading Minecraft Allspawn videos to his channel, signalling that he was potentially ending his development of the Allspawn mod. This is exactly what he did. That same day marked the release of Allspawn version 20.2, which would be the last time that the mod was updated on its Planet Minecraft forum. I would like then this mod is in 1.12. Is there a 1.8.0 version? Could you make it 1.12.2 please? It was clear by the comments of the mod that there was still lots of demand for the mod to update, but by this point I don't think they call me Danger really cared anymore. This was the beginning of the decline for the Allspawn mod. For the years that followed, the mod and its creator remained relatively stagnant. There were frequent uploads to the Richard Clark YouTube channel about his new game he was developing, but other than that the mod seemed to be basically falling off. People moved on after realising that the Allspawn mod just wasn't good anymore compared to other popular mods. However, the creator of the mod seemed to think that this mod could be something more than a hobby. He wanted to monetize the mod. This was shown by the fact that he released a merch shop, which actually isn't against Minecraft's EULA. However, this wasn't enough for They Call Me Danger. I'm going to keep this part short since I don't really understand exactly what happened, but essentially, They Call Me Danger decided to update the mod for the new version of Minecraft, but instead of releasing it for free, he planned to hire people to port the mod to the new version, which he planned to fund with a Kickstarter or a GoFundMe. This did not go well for him. After he tried to do this, a lot of drama happened between him and his Discord server, with him supposedly banning the words Biden, Kamala, Liberal and Harris from his chat, banning and muting people for pointing out he can't make people pay for a port of the mod, mass reporting users and Discord servers to take them down, among other things according to this Reddit user. Things escalated, people got doxxed, and it all came to an abrupt end when this message was posted to his website. Good riddance Discord. 
A quick goodbye to the most hateful, hurtful, nasty place I could ever imagine on the internet. It's just a horrible, terrible place with endless drama that ended up making me dread just sitting at my own computer. I, for one, will never be back. In fact, the entire Allspawn update is now cancelled. Allspawn was dead. The following months just made things significantly worse. His website was changed at first to this with a huge slogan, Proud new member of the band by Jack Dorsey Club. Jack Dorsey was the previous co-founder of Twitter, so this was referring to his band from the website. Scrolling down, you see this. Osborne got censored. At the bottom of the page was a screenshot from his game, now called Danger Zone. Unsurprisingly, his game looked exactly like Minecraft. Now the website looks like this. No one can stop the truth. If you are still unvaxxed, fight for your life to stay that way. With a link to a website called Rumble. A website that prides itself in its free speech, infamous for hosting people such as Andrew Tate. The video titled Real Zombies Very Soon, uploaded by Richard Clark, summarises his viewpoints perfectly. And you, bro, first up, you, right there, yeah, you, basic white boy, yeah, you, everybody's knocking on you these days, but you know what, you know what, you. You are the one that built the greatest civilization on the planet. You built the greatest cities the world has ever known. You built uh, the greatest army ever known to mankind. You put a man on the moon. That's right. You made all the... Here lies Allspawn, 2013 to 2021. Remember when I said that Allspawn was dead? This might not actually be true anymore. Going back to the Planet Minecraft page for Allspawn presents you with this. The Allspawn mod. Uploaded not by They Call Me Danger, but by a new person appropriately named Mr. Random User. This is the official Allspawn Planet Minecraft page. It was come back. I've worked with the Allspawn team for some time now. Although I have retired, I'm bringing it back to Planet Minecraft. Mr. Random User also has a Reddit account where he is moderators of r slash Allspawn and r slash Chaos Awakens. Chaos Awakens is a new mod for Minecraft which claims to be spiritually inspired by Allspawn with ideas from Allspawn being revamped. The original Allspawn mod might be dead, but the Chaos Awakens mod may just be able to replace it. 